everyone welcome to another market update this time we're updating for april what happened last month and comparing 2021 over 2020 and the good news is things are getting better there's a lot of sales but inventory is increasing and that's helping the market slightly balance out although the seller market is still here so let's dive into the numbers so total sales in march or excuse me april 20 20 was 27,000, or excuse me, 2,786. That increased in 2021 to 3,109, an increase of 12%. So what does that tell us? Buyer demand is still strong. Sales are increasing with it going up. Obviously it's a more of a buyer or demand side part of the equation rather than a supply, supply side because supply is also increasing at the same time. Last month, this same time, we had 1,070 active listings. Today, we have 1,348 active listings along the Wasatch Front. So, supply is increasing, sales are increasing because buyer demand is so great. Uh, list price has increased 22%. This is median list price from April 2020 to April 2021. So it was 345,000 last year, this year 420,000, a 22% increase of median list price. Sold price increased 28%. So as we've mentioned before, everything's getting bid up, everything from the $300,000 home up to the million dollar home. It's still nuts, obviously, but a 28% increase in sold price, you know, from 345,000 last year to $440,000 this year absolutely insane uh days on market still low you know they're cut in half five days on market is the median along the wasatch front last year was 10 10 is still really fast um but overall you know after looking at the numbers after seeing how inventory inventory has been slowly increasing i think our supply side of the equation is in a good place you know we've been getting more listings but the buyer demand is still so great that everything is competitive, everything is selling super fast. So if you're looking to understand the numbers a little bit more, give me a call, send me a message. I'm happy to chat more. You know, as I go out on listing appointments right now, for people who need to sell and buy, this is the conversation we have. You know, what do we need to do to sell now and what can we get into in this competitive environment? So thanks again for watching and if you have any questions, reach out. Thanks.